stretch hop. Sai John. My name is Lance Peter Sai John. That's all the North Vietnamese would ever get out of him. So today we remember that hero, a hero who made the ultimate sacrifice for his country. So behind me right here is the room that Cadet Saijon at the time stayed in. What he embodied when he, when he walked this earth was the core value of service before self. During his evasion and captivity, he was faced with a lot of perils and a lot of struggles. And he had a, a greater purpose to be here on this earth. He had a greater calling. And I think it's always important to bring back their history that got us here today. He was a kid who had his ups and downs. He tried hard, he struggled, he succeeded, sometimes he failed, and despite all those things, and despite not seeming perfect when he was here, when it really mattered out there, he did exactly what he was supposed to do and more. The Blackjacks of CS-21, Lance's former squadron, remember his courage to follow the letter of the Code of Conduct in combat and in capture, even though the torture would not stop. He was fighting to escape every day until the day he died, and I, that's absolutely beautiful. I think it's all about like grit and heart, and I think Captain Lance Visajan had that in like every way that a person can. You may have had a long day, things may not have gone your way, and then it's a good reminder to just put things back in perspective and hopefully model and exemplify what he had offered. You know, the military fights because you know we don't hate because uh, what's in front of us. It's because we love what's behind us. So. It's important for people outside the military to know his story because he gave up his life to protect them. Fifty years ago today, Captain Lance P. Sajon breathed his last breath on this earth. So let us continue to honor him by keeping his legacy alive. We'll do this by making sure that all Americans also know his story of courage, bravery, dedication, patriotism, and ultimate sacrifice. In today's world, there's so much you know, negativity. Um, towards America and in America, so I think, you know, hope is not lost. There's still good things going on in our world. No matter what you're doing in life, that's one of the most important things you can do to keep going, to not give up. Our freedom isn't free. There's always a cost.